Uh, oh Easy god, one. this this final boss fight. Oh, this so final boss fight. Whoa! Oh, oh, this new hotness. This is some new fucking hotness right here. Mmm. Mm. Okay, Vincent. God damn, that's a pretty good line. That's a pretty fucking good one! Troy Baker pulling it out. Pulling out all the stops on that one. Oh, I love fighting gods. Oh god, this is totally just the ending of Bayonetta. But with Minecraft instead. Oh, look at him! Oh, oh, this is this new fucking final boss that I specced into. Like, you know, I never thought I could love again. After, you know, what me and Thomas Mutton did, you know, as a final boss fight. I thought I was never going to get better. I thought there was never going to be, you know, another opportunity for me to, you know, love a final boss fight again. And then this happens. And then this happens. Just when I thought. Just when I thought it would never get any better and all final boss fights were the same, you pull out this shit on me. Mm. Mm. Oh, no, yeah, talk dirty to me. Talk dirty to me. Talk, talk about how, you know, low and disgusting the human race is in comparison to you, a god, a perfect being. No, no, give me all that. Whoa, a oh, Jesus, okay, I, I had it really rough there. I didn't, did I even have to do any of that? I had it really rough there because I was, I was getting, uh, I was getting T-boned between a laser beam and between whatever the, you know, and the, yeah, the laser beam and God, or like, you know, an angel firing and a laser beam. Jesus Christ, Atlas. Jesus Christ, this is a, this is a fucking final boss. Considering, considering, you know? Wow, this is a fucking final boss. This, this is some impressive shit. This is some impressive shit. You have... Goddamn, Atlas knows. Atlas Atlas knows how to make a motherfucking crescendo to a series happen. Did you guys know the Persona is really good? You gotta commit like a hundred fucking hours to it, but like... Persona's a pretty good fucking game series, and this is... This is up there. This is up there in terms of like, you know, a, uh... Whoops. This is up there in terms of like almost a Persona ending. Like, he's not like a sick-ass god or anything. He's just like... Not a... Whoa! <laughs> um, meant for that to happen? I didn't mean for that to happen, but like, it's... Oh, God damn it, Dag, Dag. I know. I know you're excited. I know you're excited. I know you're excited that there's like, you know, a brand new... There's a, there's a new flame. There's a new final boss happening on your screen right now. I get it. I get it. But like, you know, keep it in your pants. Keep it in your pants just for a minute. Just for a minute. You know what? Yeah, fuck it. Use the item. Did I even... Did I see a spare item down... I guess I'll never know. I guess I'll never know. I, I felt like there was a spare item that I could have um, worked with. I feel like there was a spare item that... Oh, God, what's he doing? I don't know what he's... Uh, what? Oh, fucking what? Yo! Oh, God damn. When the game was like, don't lose sight of your true self, I wasn't prepared for him to pull out shadow versions of me. Oh, my God. God, this final boss. Oh, <laughs> wow. Wow. Wow, my heart is a flutter. My heart is a flutter doing this final boss. Oof. 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 It was totally fucking worth it. It was totally fucking worth, like, you know, doing the Rin route again. Here I was thinking, oh, I don't know about this one, guys. Uh, it's but it was totally fucking worth it. Look at this shit. Look at what, you know, this final boss is pulling out on me. <laughs> Look at this stage we're on. No, mm -hmm. oh, okay, fuck. Fine, you got lucky there. I don't know, I just wanted to see if there was a way I could, you know, make those spring blocks happen. Oh, yeah, no, babe, I loved it. I loved it when you pulled out the shadow versions of me. They were annoying as hell, but it was a cool gimmick. No, I, I love it when you pull out the shadow, the shadow me's. Oh, come on. Oh, come on, come on. I was trying to be fast. I was trying to be fast on that one. I was trying to be fast on that. Oh, we can just do this too. Oh, you're a cheeky, you're a cheeky bugger, aren't you? You're a cheeky bugger. You're whipping out the black hole blocks on me. Like that. Like that. Um, okay. Uh, it's, it's, it's not all that. No, no. Chill out, Dad. Just do that. Look how easy that is. Look how easy that is. Oh, is that... No, 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 the horrible red face on there. That, that's that's telling me where the 
boss. It, but the boss is like right there. I can see him. He's not exactly like. It's not exactly a race. He's he's keeping he's keeping pace. I, oh come on, God, 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 chill out. Okay, Dag, just remember, just remember when that shit happens, like, all you should have to do is just kind of grip the blocks. I think that's all I gotta do. Yeah, 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 all according to plan. All according to plan. Uh, I don't know, do that. Make some shit fall down. Make some shit fall down. Make the shit fall down. Yeah, cool, this got me nothing. Yeah, cool, this got me nothing. Awesome. Fuck, it was, it was nothing. It was fucking nothing. You can use your undo, Dags. Dag, at any time. You can just use your undo. I don't want to step on the bomb block. I don't want to step on the bomb block. Yeah, fine, I'll step on the bomb block. Mm, but money. But money. But the me because I stepped on the bomb block, I've probably lost that bit of money. I've probably lost that money because I stepped on the bomb block. I'm sorry, babe. I'm sorry I stepped on the bomb block. I know you prepared a whole, you know, thing for me to get some bucks. But, you know, I was in a rush. I was in a rush, you know. You you and me, you know, we still got time. There's still plenty of level. There's still plenty of boss fight for us to, you know, go and work out our shit together, okay? I'm excited. Oh, no, is that the end? Oh, shit. Is that the end? That can't be the end of the level. Wait. Wait, game. Wait, game. W what are you doing? What are you doing? Oh! <laughs> Woo! Woo! It was the end of the game, and then the and then and then my new final boss hotness was like fuck off. No, like, no shit. You don't get a final ending. We keep goddamn going. Oh god damn it. God damn it. Oh this new final boss. I never thought I never thought I could love again, but here we are. Here we are. This final boss pulling out all the goddamn stuff. Oh, you're a motherfucker. Oh, you're a motherfucker, and I love it. I love it. I love it when you be a motherfucker to me. Did you cut the- What the fuck? Fuck ya! That was cheap! Come on, babe, that was cheap. That was some cheap shit you pulled on me, babe. Babe, that shit be cheap, okay? I love you. I love what you and I are exploring together, but that was some cheap shit. That was some cheap shit. Okay, uh, if I pull this out, do I lose the item? Okay, yeah, there's a black hole block there, so yeah, I lose the item. Damn it, shit. It'll be fun. Cut it out. I don't know what you're doing, but cut that shit out. You cut that shit out. You cut that shit. I'm trying to get your items, babe. Babe, I'm trying to get your items. You're not making it easy. Okay, babe. Okay, babe. Ah, shit, I can't get back up. Damn it. I want the item, but I don't think I can get back up. I don't think I can get back up if I do that. Shit. Babe. Babe. Ah, uh, shit, I can't get back up if I do that. Yes, I can't. No, I can't. Yes, I can't. No, I can't. Yes, I can't. No, I can't. Fuck. Ah, oh, babe. God damn. God damn, you really test me, babe. God, you... Woo! -hoo! Shit. I don't know what I was doing. I just wanted the item. Just wanted the item. Alright, let's go back for a minute. See how far I can go back. Yeah. If I do that, I can get the box, and that's fine. I needed them box. Push all of this aside. That's all. I, that's probably all I had to do. Like, ah, damn it! I needed that. I wanted that block. I wanted that block to be okay. Babe, I'm working on it. I'm working on it. But you know, you're pulling out all the stops, babe. Not like that Thomas Mutton guy. No, no. Jesus, this new hotness. Ugh, this new hotness. Oh, goddamn. Goddamn. Guys, guys, I gotta tell you. I gotta tell you about you know what me and my new final boss did last night. God, Jesus Christ, dude. Don't make this weird. It's not weird. It's love. What you, what me, and fucking, you know, God did together last night during our final boss was fucking magical. It was beautiful. Don't call it, don't call it weird. What me and God have, you know, he pulls out the laser beams and false endings. And, you know, getting, and, you know, when he pulls out the shadow clones, what me and, you know, Gabriel, I guess, ain't the angel. The Archangel Gabriel have. What we have is special. You don't need to make, you know, you don't make need to make this a weird fucking deal. Sure hope that like, you know. Oh come on. Oh come on! Ah oh, fuck you god. Fuck you, that was some cheap shit. That was some cheap shit. That was some cheap shit. Okay, God, fuck you. Fuck you for that one. Um I feel like I can pull that, push that. What the fuck is this? What's that shit? 
Why can't I? You gotta pull it. You gotta. You gotta cut that out, God. Hey, Gabriel, Angel, whatever. You gotta cut that shit out. Cut it out. Cut it out. Cut it out. I mean, you're helping. You're an idiot, God. Yeah, you're helping me. You're helping me, God. That's right. You're helping me. You thought you were trapping me. But all along, you were helping me. Oh, thank God, a checkpoint. <laughs> oh, oh. Mm. But it's not the same. It's not the same as when I was like, you know, oh, thank God, a checkpoint, you know, with my last final boss. This is, this is, this is, this is, this is something. Resay like, bullshit. That's a real person. That's, that's fucking Atlas stroking themselves right there going, oh, don't you love our characters? Isn't that, isn't that like, you know, the one? Isn't that the one Persona character that made the worst fucking parts of the, uh, the waifu wars happen or some shit? Whatever. Whatever. Yeah. Go that way. It's, it'd be more accurate. It'd be more accurate if, you know, if that game, if that game attack was fucking, um, Risei is trash. Risei, wow, Risei Lover, you died a lot there, didn't you? Didn't you, buddy? Didn't you? God, chill out. Chill out, I'm working on it, okay? I was, I'm sorry. I'm sorry that I was looking at other people during our final fight, okay? I was, I, you know, just wanted to see what they were up to. Just wanted to, you know, I just wanted to get some ideas about, you know, how not to be a total screw up in this fight. Yeah, go that way. Oh, that didn't help at all. Fuck. I'll, I'll make, we can make this, we can make this work. Babe, we can make this work. Yeah, there we go. See, it wasn't a problem. Oh God, oh God, you're pulling out so many meteors. I love it when you pull out the meteors. I love it when you pull out the meteors. Mm, I love it when you pull out the meteors. That looks like an ending to me. That looks like an ending to me. Babe, babe, you and me, come on. We can finish together. We can finish together, you and me. Man, I hate it when they, you know. I wanna get to that ending. I wanna get to that ending. But I did it. But I made it. Oh, yes! I made it. Did you make did you get there at the same time too, babe, or what? We made it. I no see what this shit is. This I, don't you do it, game. It don't you do it. it. Mm. What? Whoa, uh, whoa, whoa, game, um, what was that shit? Vi vi uh, video game? What, what the hell was that shit? I thought I was, I, you know, I was, I was fighting God. I was fighting God and minions came out of it? I think that, I think it, I, I think that killed my boner. Minions came out of God. So I think this is. So I should have gotten the true ending. Probably would have been canon for me to get the good ending, but you know, I saw it. I saw the opportunity, and I went. You know what? That'll do. I'll, I'll just go for the. I'll just go for the full ending. I'll. What the fuck is this? Brother, you accept our decision now, right? What? What? Ah. Angel. There's a joke in here somewhere. I had, I had it, I do have some jokes lined up, but, you know. I wasn't ready for this. You guys are the lonely ones. I wasn't ready for this. I thought we were having, you know, a really fun night. And then out of nowhere, you go, oh, actually, you know, I'm a minion. I thought it was weird. I thought it was a little weird. Yeah. Um. The truth is, we're aliens. What? Star system. What? Aliens? What? I originally came here to fulfill a mission for my kind. What? But to do so effectively, what? I had to have my memories erased. So... 
<laughs> okay, look. The demon, Catherine being a demon, that was a bit of a mind fuck. We're pulling out aliens now? Oh god, Rin, do you look like Sorry. that? <laughs> Serves you right. Oh, don't touch that. That's a sex organ. I was... I was having... I was having a moment, man. I was having a Gurren Lagann moment. We were fighting above the planet. I was fighting a god. And, you know... I've never... Like, my boner has never been killed any harder. God, how am I going to explain this to my ex? Listen, uh, Kay Atherin, yeah, I dumped you for, like, you know, 20 aliens in a trench coat. 20 minions in a trench coat. God, you guys are just... Ugh, Jesus Christ, you guys are annoying. Whoa, even I didn't know that. If I look up the if I look up the fucking Atlas website right now, am I gonna see these things as like merch? Me too. Wait, so uh, if that's what angels really look like, then Jesus Christ! I think, I think if like tomorrow, you know, Christianity discovered that that's what you know that's what their angels look like, I think I think you know the churches of the world would go. You know what? You know what? We can shut down this whole operation. We don't need this. You know, the last thousand years or however long, two thousand years of human history, probably more than that, all the shit we screwed up. You know what? You know what? Um, we saw what our alien, we saw what our angels looked like, and we're uh, yeah, we're willing to rescind all of that. We're we're willing to rescind. You know, the last 2,000 years of Christian intervention in, like, the entire universe. I was really scared. When I saw, like, you know, that, that ending spot right there, I was really scared. I was really scared that, like, you know, we'd be like... I, I've known Rin for a week. And he'd be like, you know what? You two can get married. Fuck it. It was really sick. It was really sick. And then, like, right at the last moment right at the last moment, you pulled out that weird thing out of your cupboard and just like, you know, you killed the mood. You killed the mood. You, you did this bit last time, lady. You don't have to explain. You don't have to. You do not have to explain the metaphors. I understand writing. I know it's a metaphor. I know it's a metaphor. Pressuring him to make his tough life decisions. Don't you agree? Like I have to watch. Now then, Vincent. Because this game is designed Angel's for adults to watch. You know, this is this is you know about adult That's relationships, and yet somehow they feel the need that adults need the fucking story explained to them. What a twist! Even without knowing Rin's true form, Vincent declared it didn't matter to him. This story might sound a little. Fun. A little. But it just goes to show a little love conquers all things. A little far fetched. You think? Just him. You think? Yeah, listen, Ren, I love you, but I can't stand it when you pull out the alien form. Often said by other people. Vincent managed to pursue a life of his own without allowing others' opinions to weigh him down. Isn't that wonderful? I feel like I've gained new opinions on aliens of all things. Also, what a, what a metaphor. Crazy. New girl who turned out to be a dude, and the metaphor is, oh, but it's an alien. I'm sure, I'm sure it sounded smarter in my head. Did I look up somewhere at one point that, like, this lady here is technically, like, a super secret final boss? I don't know how to get that. I don't fully intend it. I'm not even going to try. I'm probably not going to try, but I think that lady is actually like a, a, like a hidden boss or some shit. 
All right, so this is this is the true ending, I believe. I should have just gone for the good ending because I probably would have got the alien. I think I freaked out. You knocked nah, it out of the park. That was beautiful. What is any of that shit? Talking about it. Um, excuse me. I can't take all the credit myself. Galaxy? Thanks to Vincent. Hey, everyone having a good what time? What the fuck are you I wearing, Vinny? I thought you'd become a producer. <laughs> yeah, you're telling me. What? <laughs> whoa! Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Uh, um, uh, um, uh, um, uh, um. Something special. I thought the whole galaxy needed it. Yeah. Okay, if this is the true ending here, if I had to get the true ending to see this shit, it was worth it, but at the same time, fucking aliens? I decided to spec in the dudes and I and I accidentally made Mass Effect happen. Okay, that dude's not an alien, that's just a dude in the first suit. It would be an honor if you take my hand. We've decided to try something new too, right? I don't know if it'll work out, but we're gonna dive in and become professional wrestlers. <laughs> Making it happen. Wow, yeah. Fight professional wrestlers, <laughs> I guess. I'm going this. to be a music producer to aliens. Me too. I gotta start saving some. Hey, money. Catherine. No more get Catherine. You and I had a long-standing relationship, but I gotta tell you, I'm it's into aliens like now. It's gotten a little easier for him. It's all thanks to you, Rin. You mean thanks to the both of us? You're right. No matter what comes our way, with you by my side, we can do anything. It's like the two of us are unstoppable. I love you, Rand. This fucking... This fucking... This is the re-release, huh? If you're willing to explore your sexuality a bit, you might unlock aliens. We might make first content... First contact. <sighs> okay, if that was the true ending right there, then it was totally fucking fucking worth it. <sighs> but okay, so it took it took a second run, it took a second go, but we've done it. We've made it to the end of the re-release of Catherine. We've made it to the end of Catherine Full Body. Okay, so what did I think of that game? I feel like yeah. Having, you know, having played, having finally played, you know, this game a second time through and all that, yeah. Doing the first run, I sort of realized how cagey I was going to be about my own relationship shit. But I was able to, I feel like, you know, maybe doing this run, I was able to flip it back a little bit. Just, you know, bring back the comedy shit. No, it's, it's not, we're not talking about how I did. This isn't about my performance. This is about the video game's performance, isn't it? Um, they're obviously trying for something. They obviously, you know, Vincent, uh, sorry, Atlas is trying to expand its horizons. Obviously with Rin. I feel like they still want to, like, you know, sit in the comfort zone for a bit. It, like, with Rin going, oh, but, like, clearly Rin looks like a girl or some shit. And, yeah, they didn't bring up the whole cross-dressing thing, but, like, that that's straight. I think that's, like, an actual Japanese term for it that I looked up um, or something. But, like, yeah. Um, I had to be a bit cagey about what pronouns I wanted to use for Rin. And even then, I still wasn't getting it right a lot of the... What do you mean, style not enough? Oh, it's just a company. Like, I still feel like I absolutely wasn't getting it right. But, like, yeah, guess what? Guess what? It was, you know, it's not going to be easy. It's not going to be easy to get it right. We live, we live in the era where, like, you know, gender is being explored. Where, like, you know, people are being a bit more comfortable, you know, being open about, like, gender and such. What am I fucking trying to talk about? What am I trying to talk about? What did I think this game got right? I think the Gurren Lagann fucking ending was sick. And then killed my boner right at the end of it. I feel like the Rin stuff, questions-wise, it started really fucking weird because it stopped being about relationships and being started being about, like, Transformers and pizza and shit, and that was fucking weird. But I think, in a way, it was sort of like psyching you up for like the next round of questions when it became shit about uh, actual relationships and true love and junk. So that was, you know, it was dumb when it started, but I, I, I think it flipped around. I think it flipped around at the end. And they actually managed to make it, it, like flip it back into a relationship thing by conditioning you into thinking a certain way. The thing about the conditioning a certain way was that, yeah, 
it is like right at the end there. You saw with that one question that would have made the difference between me getting the, you know, my ending and the correct ending. The correct ending, yeah. It kind of tricked you into uh, wanting to answer the questions correctly, not wanting to answer the questions truthfully. So I, you know, I don't 100% feel the new Rin stuff was handled as well because it's not, it's not the binary scale thing. It's tr like correct or not. I don't think the correct or not thing is a great way to have done it. But like, I, I guess they didn't have a lot of options. What's your other option? Make, you know, all the all the questions in this have like three answers and you gotta get like, you know, three answers correct, I guess. And also like, I know what you're going for with Rin, okay? Clearly, you know, the whole metaphor of like, it's Vincent being confronted with having to grow up. K. Atherin represents, guess the fuck what? If you want to stick with K. Atherin, you gotta grow the fuck up. You gotta get your shit together. You gotta get married so you can, and you know, so you can look after this person with a kid. Like, that's the, that's the metaphor right there. And Q Atherin comes along to go, oh yeah, nah, it's cool, like, you know, you be yourself. And if that means, you know, you want to keep collecting your Bionicles and your Tarzos and all of that shit, you can keep doing that. It's okay, don't look at me like that. Don't look at me like that. The problem is that comes presented as, oh, Q Atherin looks like a fucking child. Q Atherin looks like a god, he looks like a kid. And it's creepy. Q Atherin is just creepy. Because of that. Because of the way that they felt the need to represent, you know, that metaphor. I understand the metaphor, but you can't present the metaphor like that and not make it creepy. That's all there is to it. That's, that's always going to be creep. That's always going to be creep. And, like, there, there's straight up an age difference as well, I believe. Oh, God, we totally got married. <laughs> We've known each other a week. Okay, well, no, technically months, but that's not helping. Oh, and hey, Johnny got with an alien. You know what? Sure. Sure. I'm cowarding out exploring dudes while he's exploring aliens. Aliens don't even have penises. Like you, you, like you, the guy in the comments, you're like, oh, no, I'd totally bang an alien. No, you probably wouldn't. No, you wouldn't because... They, you know, aliens would not evolve with the same organs as us. They'd evolve with their own shit. You think you can just bang anything in Mass Effect? Guess what? That thing doesn't have one. Its its sex organ is like in its... It's like in its arm, in its hand. You know that, you know those horrible eye things that the big brother have? Yeah, that was, that, that's where you gotta stick it. That's where you gotta stick it. That's the organ right there. Good luck. Good luck. That was a really fucking weird way to end this game, but this is a really fucking weird game. This is a really fucking weird game. It was weird before it got re-released, and it's weird now, but that's kind of sick, and there's not a lot of other games that, are, that you know, no other, there is no other game like this that, you know, is willing to explore that shit to this degree. I'm sure there is, but, like, a game about adult relationships, that just, that doesn't happen all that often. And that was a cool way to do it. That was that was a cool way to do it, I guess. Alright, are those my thoughts? Are those my thoughts on the Sea Atherin game? I guess so. Oh, right! There's a bunch of new endings and shit. For K Atherin and C Atherin, isn't there? That's a whole thing. Hey, you guys remember that one night? Me. You guys remember that one night on where the game was like, oh, this secretly you Rin unlocks different endings. Like you have to tell both of the crazy, Catherines that, oh yeah, no, nah, I totally know that Q Atherin, dude. No, I totally know them. The, the secret is that, yeah, your response actually unlocks a different really ending? Then you actually unlock brand new endings for both of these characters? Does it matter? The heart doesn't lie. You enjoyed it, didn't you? <laughs> okay, that seems... <sighs> Maybe Mountains to... out of molehills. Okay, fine. Okay, fine. So I invented a girl. Okay. Okay. So maybe I paid for a Pornhub premium subscription. And I might have used your bank account. I might have used your card to pay for that. But you're making a bigger deal about this. There was no I one there. Understand. Stop making a big deal about this, Kay Atherin. Oh, is that- I, I feel like that's your new- that's your new catchphrase that you invented for this game specifically. 
She wasn't saying that in the original, I think. Oh. Oh, so you're getting sick ass party invites. That, that, that's, that's, that's the, uh, that, okay, yeah, cool, that's the ending. The ending is, she dropped a card. She, she dropped a card and it was like, oh shit, I actually got invited to a party. When does that ever happen? Well, what awaited him in the end was not quite what he bargained for. She walked out anyway. I maxed out my meter and I even told her about this, like, piano player at work. She broke up with me anyway. Dude, dude, come on. Dude, come on! Yes, the ending is her dress. All the temptation. Wonder what's in store for him. Hmm. Doesn't look like it'll be as peaceful as he hoped. Now, hmm. What did all you players out there think? Of I this? think this outcome is too difficult to get. After all, I think I think it's a little bit too much of a head scratcher. I think it's a little bit too much. Like, what, what's the likelihood? What's the likelihood that someone's gonna get this, like, you know, playthrough zero? Their first ever playthrough. Let's take a look into the near future. <laughs> yes, okay, that's that's okay. You've you've ruined the metaphor enough, lady. Hope to see you soon. I feel like this isn't something that Atlas like normally would do. Surely it, you know, Atlas just wouldn't just fucking <sighs> You can trust us, Atlas. It's okay. Catherine, come on. Why aren't you picking up? I mean, maybe at a certain point, Vinny, you should probably just give up. If she's not picking up, there's probably a point where you should just, like, Catherine? give up. Oh my god, you had all this money and you never told me? I was living in that shit-ass apartment and all you had to do was, like, can I, like, lend a couple of bucks from you or what? I for work. I get invited to parties like these sometimes. Oh, designer stuff? That's right. I thought it'd be good for my career, so I started going to them. Then a fashion magazine ran a story on me, and here I am now. Wait, no, you had all- you had all this? You had all this and you never told me? Sorry, I have plans. Oh, no, oh god, no, god, he's trying something. I have to go, I have to go right the fuck now. Catherine! Catherine! Catherine, this is for you! No, I can't. Catherine! Catherine. I told you! Next week! Oh, wait! Hold on! Are those like Pokemon boats? Like you have to choose between red, blue, and green? Or what? Oh my god, I'm being- Oh my god, the rich are attacking me. Oh my god, I have to do a, like a sick-ass battle royale for my ex. Well, with a bunch of rich people. Oh, you felt always- You felt tied down. Yeah, it would have been nice if you realized that the other 30 hours of the game. You take that freedom and go live your life. I tried that and you broke up with me over it. I tried that. And you broke up with me over it. That that's that that's that's a peer, buddy. Vinny, Vinny, that's a peer. You're gonna you're gonna hit a dead end. You're gonna you're gonna hit a dead end there, Vinny. Vinny, you're you're gonna hit a dead end. Maybe stop that. I actually kinda really dig that ending. I kind of dig that ending in a way. It's like, uh, it's, it's like a fun flip on the script for the sort of the K. Atherin story. Literally like, oh, you had things too good and you were like, no, but I need to, I need to, ex I need to, you know, explore new shit. I want, I want, you know, new shit in my life. And of course the, uh, and of course the outcome of that is like, you lose what you, it's literally that fucking Shrek Shrek 4? Shrek 4 moment where he literally just blurts out loud, Cause I didn't know what I had until it was gone! Like yeah, that's, 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 that's all that is. But I think that's, considering what this game is and what this game reps, I think that's a really good, uh, I think that's a really good spin. I think that is a really good spin on, um, on what the original game had. That's a, that's a good, that's a good ending. That's a good ending that you added to the video game. What about that other girl though? Didn't she have another ending as well? Listen, listen, I've, I've, I've reset the universe so many times. I've, I've, I've set the, I've reset the universe so many times trying to get with you and every single time it never worked. It never worked. I kicked, I kicked your boss's ass. It was, it was awesome. It was fucking awesome. No, I need, I need, I need one of those like, you know, horrible demon cloakers. I'm all about that. It wasn't easy, to be honest. It's been a real roller coaster of emotions. 
I need to, I need to, I need that thing to have like teeth in places I've never thought. I need to be confronted. I need to be confronted. I did a job. I was only helping him out on a whim. I didn't expect. Um, hang on, hang on. Okay. <laughs> yeah, no, that's cool. Uh, that, that's cool. But like, you know, 20 se yeah. seconds. The conversation has been like, you know, 20 seconds. You didn't have to. Different circumstances. But I can't change the past. I mean, I, you know, I was working on like a time machine in my apartment, but it was really just like a cardboard box with a couple of dials on it. And it didn't really, uh, it didn't work. It didn't work out. Oh my God, you have it. Oh my God, you have a time machine too. Um, hey, hey, you awake? Or you are a time. Oh my God, who the fuck is, oh my God, who are these people? Typical Vincent for you. Eric, I bet it was a wet dream. Paul? I thought you That's Paul? Me. What's going on? That dweeb on the far left is Paul? Remember? Okay. Also, um Hey. Who's the who's who's that person with the red hair? What's what's going on there? Check out the new uh, What's what's going on there, Atlas? Did you say their name was Oh my god, you look like such a dweeb as a teenager. Don't worry, we all look like dweebs as a teenager. I'm only just getting out of my dweeb phase now. Family's been through a lot. Really? The guy needed something to lift his spirits. I reset the universe to make you extra jelly. Oh, look how jelly she is. Oh, look how jelly she is. I reset the universe to make you jelly. Can't believe those two are getting married. Okay, so this is the thing that brought up a lot of a lot of issues with the reissue. Yeah, see that that dude with the red hair there, <clears throat> that person with the red head there. Yeah, that's just what if Erica never transitioned, and that's ah uh, lol. Uh, you got stuck with that Paul wanker. Uh, but anyway, as we're saying, yeah, that's sort of a uh, that's sort of a concern. Are you sure that's the that's what you want to do? There, I get it. People are curious. Are you sure, like, are you sure you want to reset the, like, I can't remember if they changed up the line in English. I don't know what the line is in Japanese, but I think the implication wasn't done too well and the English actors went, no, okay, just listen, listen, we're going to take this over, okay. This is the universe where what if Erica hasn't transitioned yet, okay. That's that one, but yeah. Cool. It's, it seems like you may have reset the universe. Oh, God. Oh, God. You're into that universe resetting kink too, are you? Oh, oh, that's what I've always wanted. Oh, I've always wanted someone who is, like, willing to, you know, made in heaven the universe for us to be together. Ah, okay. So, so, so the new endings. The new endings are like a... a Atlas, is that a fucking meme? Atlas, is that a fucking meme? Did you make a fuck? Jesus Christ, C calm down. Calm down, you two. Calm down, you two. You think you could pull that shit in P5R as well? I saw what you were doing with that salt sprinkling meme. You're not subtle. You're not subtle, Atlas. We all saw. We all fucking saw, Atlas. But yeah, um, okay, so the new endings are kind of like a role reversal, I guess? Like the idea is instead, now that these characters are... Uh, now instead these characters like, what if Kay Atherin is like, you know, the seductress, the one that you're like, oh no, I have to get in on that. I have to get in on that. I do and then C Atherin is like, yeah, what if I just what if what if, what if you married me instead? But I thought you were all about the one who was like, no, I don't want to get married. No, I don't want to get like tied down and shit. Oh fuck that noise. No, I will reset the universe so hard for you, babe. I love it when you reset the universe for me, babe. Okay, but yeah, that's it. That's uh that's all of Catherine. You can't say that I didn't, you know, cover all our bases. I got all the C. Catherine game done for you so that you don't have to. I told you, by the way, I told you 30 something episodes of this series and I told you. I told you it wasn't porn. I told you there was not a single piece of pornographic content in this entire game. You didn't believe me, did you? I told you it's not porn. It's not. It's not.